The Minister for Local Government, Rafael Majezi, laid before Parliament the statutory instrument for the approval of Parliament to extend the tenure of local council one and two. Number 63 of 2023. The Speaker of Parliament, Anit Anita Among, then buried members from debating the new legislation. What we wanted is a, an instrument, a legal instrument, extending the term. But the MPs who did not object the legal procedure wanted to have their minds cleared if the government did not hide behind the law to address the failure to beat the deadline of 10th July 2023. This silently increased the momentum of what looked like a debate. Because, and the Minister of Finance, Madam Speaker, needs to come on, the, on record and inform the country that during the budget presentation, you did not provide for the necessary source. Otherwise, Madam Speaker, we will have a problem on the ground. I bet. As Parliament, we approve what is given to us. We don't go on a fishing expedition. We only approve what is brought to the House. Minister Magese's justification for the extension is derived under the Section 175, 1 and 2 of the Local Government Act resulting into the insertion of a new clause dubbed 11A, which ingredients lead to a status of an extremely difficult or impossible to conduct elections for the administrative unit councils. Speaker, and given the urgency of the matter, may I um, move the motion that you put the question? Madam Speaker, no. No, 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 no. If you are not prepared, please do not, do not, no, no. We are not going to allow you to do that. If you are not prepared, Honorable no, no. Law. No, yes, 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 let me be patient. Honorable Law. The key word, extremely difficult, as legally stated, was the main contentious issue during the debate. The words extremely difficult are got from the Constitution. They are not a creation of anybody. Madam right Speaker, there is no situation where it's extremely difficult for local government to function and other governments, are, parts of government are functioning. And that's why it's in the Constitution. What, what we could do, let him say in this amendment that when it has be financially become difficult to organize the elections, let us be specific. Otherwise, making it this broad is susceptible to abuse, and that's where my problem is. The leader of opposition, Matthias Impoga, told the House that such a situation may attract an amendment to repeal the provision which empowers the minister to cause extension of such elections. You know, sometimes we want to win at all times, even when there's nobody to defeat. Although Parliament approved the extension of the term of office for the LOCs 1 and 2, the source of finances to conduct the elections within six months period is still uncertain. Why should we start speaking about supplementary? Daniel Mugoya, Gloria Gutabinji, UBC News.